It's August 6th, 2019. Uh, just a quick video of a really cool mushroom I found in the yard. I've never found one of these, but uh, it basically caught my eye because it's blue. You can see some really blue, deep blue spots in there. From the top, only a faint blue color. I actually ran over several of these with lawnmower and they sent blue shards everywhere and I was uh, fascinated. So I stopped, picked a few, and here they are. <coughs> Excuse me. After looking them up, um, I found out that this mushroom is called Lactarius indigo, which I believe means blue milk, something to that effect. And you can see why. <coughs> Excuse me. Anywho, if you cut them open, you'll notice a really bright blue color in there. It's just unbelievably blue. I can't even wrap my head around how blue that is. I wonder if there's a way to capture that color and somehow uh, make it into a dye for textiles. Who knows? Digging a little deeper, I found that these mushrooms are edible. In fact, the last time I found some of these uh, in the yard, we ate them. We fried them up in butter. And they were good. It was a good texture, a real good initial flavor, but they kind of had a bitter aftertaste that I didn't really care for. My girlfriend liked them, but me personally, I wouldn't eat them again, especially when there's much better mushrooms out there. Um, you know, if I had to describe exactly how they taste, um, I would say if you've ever had a bluet mushroom, they taste very similar to that, only with a, a bitter aftertaste. So, bluets are awesome eating. These, not the best, but just, just the cool blue coloration. That's really what caught my eye. I think it's really neat. Let's get another one in view here. Look at that. Isn't that awesome? You don't really find this color in nature very often, especially here in Vermont. So when you do, it's really something. Anyways, that's all. Signing off.